yeah, what's up with it? Do it cause I love it and I stuck with it We ain't with the sub and in the cut with it Please none the talks, I heard enough of it Like, what you gon' do, where you at, who you with? You ain't really bout this, don't talk about it Really on the move, on the map, never slip Keep your hands to your lips, don't talk about it Real eyes, real lies, real lives All the time, stand on it, if we said it, we don't walk around it Loose lips, ink ships, red cup, blue strips New phone, who this, no we don't allow it Really on go, I don't know what's an off day. Now we on road, came from. All right, y'all. So, JI, JI in the six speed. It's been a minute since we seen this. It's, it's been a minute since we seen this. See, this is exactly why I got rid of my steering wheel. He is. Y'all thank him. For the ones that love my carbon fiber steering wheel, <laughs> y'all can thank him because yeah. I got in his car one day. Um, the reason why I was sad, but it, nonetheless, I got in his car and I touched his steering wheel and it feels like fucking Alcantara. But my steering wheel, I got back in my car same day <laughs> and touched my steering wheel and it felt like leather. <laughs> so I had to get rid of it. But dude, this is, uh, yeah, brand new fucking car, y'all. He's not capping. 8,000 miles. Sheesh. His car makes my car look like a dinosaur, and I just <laughs> barely hit 24 grand. Actually, your car made me, like, I saw it a few times when I was waiting for mine, and that's actually how I found you on YouTube, because oh, I real? was watching Camaro 1LE videos, because I was just <laughs> waiting for mine so bad, and then when I saw where you worked, because I recognized it, yeah. I was like, I gotta meet this dude. Hell yeah. Someone that has the 1LE, they know, and yeah, man. Hell yeah. Common interest. Oh God, man. And that's damn, so that's how it happened. That's so how it happened. so you came in with Vader. Yeah, and I saw okay. I got behind you a few times. Uh, oh damn. In this one? Not in this one. Okay, okay, no, okay. Just, before, before. For it. Yeah, okay, and I okay. heard yours and I was like, Yeah, need can't it. Wait to get it. <laughs> your car made me last like a few more months without freaking out. Just damn. because I knew what what I was waiting for. Hell yeah, that's what's up, man. That's see, this is what we do it for, man. For real car enthusiasts out there that actually like are going to appreciate it you know these cars are basically your own work of art you put in your modification your spin on it at the end of the day they're made at the same place they're made by the same people they're made off the same design it's the same car it's just up to us to modify it how we would want it to be and make it you know what i'm saying our car and that's exactly what he's done with his car you know what i'm saying like even with him leaving it stock the way that he specced it you feel me from factory is still his touches on the car you see what i'm saying so all right y'all i think i got my seat good and my boy got me in track mode too man and we're off
make the car just set it up however I want to drive it and experience it. Like, Facts. A hundred percent. So, but like the most annoying thing for me is when I go to car shows, is everybody's like, "What are you gonna do with your car?" I'm always like, "I can't uh, wash it and make sure it's in good condition." <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I mean that's fucking it. They've already tried to steal this car too, but we don't bro, want to talk about what? that. Bro, what? But, it's um, like damn, yeah. bro. Some people Leave in Houston can't alone. Some people in Houston don't want to work. They just want to take it. Boy, what? Like, they just want to take it. My man's alone. I feel like that was another reason why that six ten that I drove, like, it made me fall in love with the trans because it was like, it's butter whether you have that on or off. Right. I don't know. I, I can admit that I still haven't learned the hill to toe downshifts. Oh, okay. But I like how easy. I don't know. It's. Just, I just want the car to be fun. You already I, have to think a lot about how to drive to these bikes. I hope no. I hope that the Insta 360 caught that, bro. He was riding in between these motherfuckers. I give him no smoke in your car. You want to? So speaking of motorcycles, I was actually on the night where the Astros were doing the World Series. Uh huh. I'm not a big baseball player or watcher person, so <laughs> I was on the freeway. I was um, getting it with two crotch rockets, two bikes, and they must not have been like high CC bikes because dude, they were we, keeping up. I was keeping up with one of them. So either he didn't know how to drive, or it was just like, <laughs> like a 600 CC. But I don't know. I was like always in the right gear. Oh man, it was so much fun. My wife was with me. Oh yeah, yeah, I know. Dude. See, when you say that, it's like, I, I can't lie. As a man, you feel me? Like, when your girl's in the car, and you're keeping up with some shit that you didn't think you were gonna keep up with, it's like, yeah, babe, yeah, I'm there. Yeah, yeah, we're, we're in there. Dude, she can drive this car pretty good, too. With the, uh, like, in the turns, too? Yeah, like, we take turns whenever we're out in the hill country and stuff. Oh, there's this brown Corvette. Oh yeah, that's C8. Yep, C8. You don't see too many of that color. Not at all. Well, I know he's not going to do it because there's also a car in front of him. But for all you people that want to feel a little bit of a G-Force, this is take I-10 and I-45 North in Mexico and make it <laughs> a little bit. <laughs> yeah, in Mexico for sure. If you're a passenger, really make it Bro, what? It, no, if you're a passenger in this guy's car. <laughs> <laughs> I've had people screaming at me. And what's funny is, like I said, I never do when I do myself the people in the car because... I'm not gonna be responsible for someone's life. Life. I can't take it. Uh, I think he's having fun, y'all. I, I definitely like he keeps talking about that 10 speed. <laughs> but, yeah, 10 speed's nice and whatever, whatever. <laughs> but wait till we get to the hill countries you know, or the uh, up near College Station where I got some roads planned for him. He, he might be wanting to. Uh, you you think I might want to swap cars or something? He, he might want to <laughs> change his direction. I'd be like, yeah, fast, going fast, straight's cool and all, but <laughs> going around a turn at 120 miles an hour. Which, that, that, that's, that's wild that's ass where it's shit. At. Nah, my wife would never, <laughs> my wife would never sink the car. Yeah, let me do that. Hell no. Nah. Yeah, definitely was fun. I can't wait until we hit the hill country. Again, huge shout out to my mans, bro. Appreciate you again, bro. Not even just for letting me drive the car, but also just the ride along. Right along, I was telling him off camera, like, it's been a damn it, you motherfucker. All right, well, I guess we're taking this exit now. It's all right. Um, yeah, we'll just skip it. But, um, nah, like, I was telling him off camera, man, like, I, I've i kind of been in a little bit of a funk as far as, like, the creative space goes, man. 
just not having my car or not being able to shoot content it's hard to explain but it's like it messes with you you know what i'm saying so like that's what it is for me for like with the car like i can't go out get in my car and you know shoot a video that's entertaining for y'all basically so being able to get back in a camaro yet alone a 1le first time experience like the manual firsthand actually whipping it around corners and stuff like that how it's supposed to be driven yeah man it just was I re thank you bro appreciate You're very it welcome, man, man. Like, i really like you know what i'm saying i need it's like a kickstart man all right y'all so we're back in america you dig what i'm saying just touched down just finished driving the 1le 2023 to 2022 1le you dig what i'm saying as y'all can see 2SS, not the 1SS. I have the 1SS. Bro has all the extra bells and whistles, and this car is phenomenal. It did not disappoint by any means. If anything, this car, like, in a manual and also in a 10-speed, it's just, it's just as crazy. It's literally just as crazy. But with that being said, man, it's going to wrap it up for today's video. Huge shout out again to my guy. It's Pless the Mess. Yes, sir. It's a beautiful car he has here. Letting me drive it at 8,000 miles is insane, completely OD. Um, I can't wait to get to the hill country. I can't wait to get Vader back so he can drive Vader and I can make him a believer of the 10 speed. You <laughs> dig what I'm saying? And and then we can get some real like back road driving for real. I'm, I'm super stoked and maybe even we can set up a, a autocross date. Maybe we go to the track and that really, I really want to. Yes. Like we could drop, um, I'm good with Mike Hawk over there, the Chevrolet dealership. We could have them do the track spec alignments and all that, the whole servicing before we go and all that. That'd be awesome. Hell yeah. So yeah, man, we y'all just stay tuned. I'm telling y'all, I'm really